Let's go to Proverbs chapter 12, verse 1. To the left is the King James Version. To the right is the Expanded Bible. Whoso loveth instruction, loveth knowledge, but he that hateth reproof is brutish. So what does reproof mean? Hey, let's look it up. An expression of blame or disapproval. So what does brutish mean? Showing little intelligence or sensibility. So whoso loveth instruction loveth knowledge. So if you are the type of person that is willing to submit to instruction, to being told what to do when it is right, when someone is correcting you, you are willing to take in that correct information. If you are that way, you love knowledge and you are going to become wiser or receive more wisdom. But he that hateth reproof, so we said that reproof is what? An expression of blame or disapproval. So, but he that hateth reproof, being told what to do, being told, hey, you should not do that, or if a warning comes to you, you are like, who are you to judge me? What are you saying? You don't know me. <laughs> but he that hateth reproof is brutish. So when you hate to be corrected, what this is saying, you are brutish. Brutish is what? Showing little intelligence or sensibility. So... <laughs> What this is saying, if you don't like to be told what to do, to be corrected when it is right, what this is saying, and let's make it in a very, let's say it in a very easy way. This is saying, and I am not trying to offend you, this is saying that you are stupid, you are foolish. A person like that is stupid, is foolish. This is what the Bible is saying. So when someone calls you a brute, <laughs> what is that? I don't believe a brute is an intelligent person, right? Of course not. So... I pray that this makes sense. We want to make sure that if we are doing wrong, we have to be willing to take correction. Because how can I grow? How can anyone grow if you are not willing to take correction? You can't believe that we do everything right. I know for myself, <laughs> I make mistakes myself. So if someone sees something in me that I don't see, and if I am not willing to take correction, I am going to be foolish. I am going to be stupid. I am going to be a moron. So... The only reason why I know what I know now, yes, it is the Holy Spirit. Yes, it is God. But at the same time, I am willing to humble myself and be corrected. I know for back when I was in sin, my dad would tell me, Kevin, you are in sin you are this, you are that, and you need to change that, blah, blah, blah. And I was thinking, I don't care. 
So when I was in sin, I was so foolish. I made so many mistakes because why? Because I was not willing to take heed to correction when it came down to things of God. So all in a nutshell, what this is saying, hey, don't be stupid. Don't be foolish. Take correction. Stop getting offended every time when someone is trying to correct you. Especially if a person is correcting you based upon the Bible and with love. So let me stop here. God bless you.